Hello, this is Helm4004, and welcome back to the Zap SMP Season 3. This is number 2 for my channel, and starting out, I think it's time to gather some resources, so then we can do some things later on during today's episode. But let's go mining, and maybe even exploring some lower ground caves in our area. Okay, so it looks like we have found a bit of a cave here and we are at deep slate level that's not too bad that's pretty good any mobs there seems to be a strange lack of mobs there's like no mobs here I mean I'm quickly lighting up the place to keep there from being mobs but there's no mobs here now that is a score Although there's not exactly any diamonds here either. I guess I'll just continue lighting this... What is that? What is that down there? What is that? Saw something blue and it sure didn't look like diamonds. I mean, this this cave looks nice. There's a skeleton. Maybe... Oh no. D do you see that right there? I guess I'm just gonna continue my staircase down and pretend that everything's okay even though I'm heading right down to the warden's den oh that's kinda scary right there okay a zombie starting to see me it's kinda dark right here is this the part where I just leave it alone uh oh um hmm deep dark death that's awesome I'm gonna bring a single glowberry and let it grow. But I suppose that's a major punch in the face when I go down into the deep dark biome with only a leather helmet on. What an idiot I am. So honestly, I'm going to place a glowberry vine right there and let it grow. And back down I go. I just really hope that nothing blew up of my stuff. There it all is. Um, I'm setting off the skulk sensors. That's nice. I'm just gonna light up this cave a little bit. For you, that's why I'm lighting it up, Mr. Creeper. That's kinda scary. But I'm not seeing any shriekers, and I am fine with that. No shriekers from me. No shriekers from me. There's a shrieker. That's a shrieker. Uh-huh. Do I walk? Oh, no. Did I... Is is the warden... Uh, do I keep going? Um... Just gonna place some torches? It's fun. That, that was three. That was three, right? Am I fine? I don't feel fine. Is it... Um... Is it... Is there... D d d warden? Warden? No. No. No, 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 no. 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 I'm down here in less than a leather cap. And there's a warden right over there. I just... I just angered the warden. Uh, that's... There's the warden. Oh, he's gonna kill it? He killed it! He killed the skeleton! What a good warden. Kill the rest of the mobs down here while you're at it. Why is he still walking this direction? There is a case. Running away is sometimes okay. For seeming this is my territory, a lot of mobs could get in, especially when I have a warden in my basement. And, you know what, I went mining to hopefully get some iron. I got four raw iron down there, and that's all good and fine. But I also got a bunch of cobblestone. At any point, the warden could literally stab me in the back from deep underground. And I do not feel safe in this area. I'm gonna build me a wall. So right here is the nice sacrifice pit in my little bridge. But if I were to... Hmm... Let's, let's take a look. Right here is where my house is. Obviously, right here is a good place to have an edge. So a wall could kind of come around here 
There could be a door right here. And it just, the wall keeps going around this way. And then you know what? I might want to make a moat. I might have this whole area flooded with water. And I'm going to make a river. And that will keep me safe from at least my base to my little farm right here. I'm going to make a wall. Okay, that's a nice stretch, but I don't really like this style of log when for seeming I want to make this a big jungle themed area. So unfortunately these logs are time to remove their bark because their bark is worse than their bite. And I know that this is going to be the most ugliest plain wall that you've seen in Minecraft since the Zap SMP Season 2. But you know what? For now, it works. Okay, okay, I know this is the most ugly wall you've seen in a while. And a couple things I could do is some stone variations along the stone parts, or maybe even just adding in some slabs and some stairs. And I could easily do that right now, but no, I'm going to do something that will make it look more dumb until I make it look better. But trust me, this will look better. But first, before we do any of that, we're going to go on a little adventure, and it requires caving, but not in the deep dark, we've already angered the warden once. You think I'm crazy if I'm gonna go down there again for a while. So you see that big nasty mouth of the hill and the raining mist? Well, it's time to say goodbye to its teeth. Yes, because this has teeth. I went on a little adventure earlier, just trying to get to know the area a little bit. And this is a nice little dripstone cave. And the truth is, I don't need all that much dripstone. I can grow some, because right now a skeleton's trying to kill me and I just want some dripstone. And I didn't even grab any. Let's... Oh man, that skeleton has some pretty good aim. That's not okay. Yikes, I'm gonna die in the middle of nowhere. If you're gonna build something you don't care about, you might as well put it right in your side yard to look at every time you wake up. Ouch, some growing dripstone. Okay, I, I've been putting it off long enough, but one thing I can do while I wait for the dripstone to grow is just make the wall look a bit nicer. So one of the things I like to do in some of these places is where the wall reaches a corner like this, I can make it seem like, okay, it's crumbling down. Well, what's crumbling down? The wall, because it's not in good shape anymore. Now, I may not be the best builder, and I'm literally only building with cobblestone right now, but even those couple stairs to make a hole in the wall spruce this place up just that little bit more. But now it's time to make a nice door in the wall, and that's what I'm going to do right now. But FYI, I'm wearing a bunch of iron armor. But uh, would I ever record anything out of order? No, never. Yeah, I get iron armor next episode, and halfway through next episode, the wall's randomly going to disappear because I recorded this after. Now that, that's special. But I guess it's time to put on a roof of the future. Yeah, um, perfect. Perfectly in order, and what a nice wall. I will continue it a bit along this stretch, and that should be the wall done. Now there is something I wanted to do since the last time that I've been on the server, and now that we are close to a few other members, like I know Double Z is right over there, I have a proposal for him. But I need to make a sign, he's not on the server right now, and it'd be way too easy to drop him a Discord message, so I'm going to make him play Minecraft, and find a random sign place randomly, and yeah, I could just text him on Discord, but why would I? I, I have signs and Minecraft. So I don't know why I do stupid things while I have a very low food supply right now, but I guess I just want to climb to a top of a mountain. Now that is smart. Okay, I guess um, that must be his little acacia base. Oh look, it, he even has a little horse. Actually, is, is his base like on stilts? Oh, 
if, if that was one block further, it could look like this is like a whole little igloo on still. He has an Olay! Oh, now what a cute little guy. That's awesome. Here's a watermelon. Actually, I won't click him because I might accidentally take him off a lead. But, I'm going to go ahead and leave him a message. I went ahead and did the thing. Basically, this is telling him, your base is here. My base is there. We could maybe make a tunnel through the mountain or a path winding down the mountain that connects our two bases, making a nice, easy transport system from here to there. So, I walked all the way over here just to put down three signs that he probably won't even read. So, time to continue. Ba oh no, powdered snow. Powdered snow? That's a killer. And with that, that is the end of this video for today. Maybe next time we'll be able to hear from Double Z and get a path going, or continue the jungle a bit more. But that was enough warden death defying things and wall buildings for today. So for now, this is Helm4004 saying goodbye.